<laughs> Welcome back to Theme Park Wizard. And as you may have seen on my live stream yesterday, this website was not working. At least the ticket portion um, yesterday. But now I decided I want to do a little video series, a, a kind of video mini series of the next few weeks tracking Halloween Horror Nights to get updates just so, so you guys are aware. So every Friday starting today and going all the way to the start or going all the way until they're sold out completely, um, I'm doing a Halloween Horror Nights ticket update for all ticket types so you guys have an idea of when when to go and if your date is sold out or not. So let's go ahead. We're here. We're going to start off with general admission. This range from six nine days to nine six nine dollars to ninety nine dollars. So let's look at the dates here. So when we go, okay, September looks like everything is a okay. Everything's open. Um, opening day is open. Only six nine dollars on Thursday and Friday, which is pretty good considering it's opening weekend and Sunday. But it is September. We got seventy four dollars here and seventy nine dollars. Seventy nine dollars. So the seventy nine dollars is highest to pay in September, which is not bad. Moving over to October, everything's also still open here. Highest price is ninety nine dollars. I do know, though, you should get if you even if you want to go in October, and it's not sold out, you should still get your tickets because I if if it's like years past, these numbers will slowly start to rise up into the hundreds. I'm like, especially as demand increases. So if it's like that. These 99s have become like 119 or something. So definitely get the price before it starts like rising higher. But they're all good. Everything's open for September through October. And it doesn't look like, usually goes to like November 3rd or something, but maybe because that's usually a weekend. Maybe because October 31st, Halloween's on a Sunday. It ends on that day because it's like kind of like a perfect end. So that's nice. So let's go ahead to. The next ticket type, Universal Express. Universal Express again starts at one ninety nine um, for October first. Well, let's go in September. So one seventy nine. Everything's open here for Universal Universal Express. It's just a one time Express Pass. One time Express Pass, um, meaning you can use Express on. Each maze and attraction one time, then you have to wait in the regular line if you want to go on again. So that's that. Right. Everything's open here. Everything's open here. So we're good. So far, good. And then again, it's July 23rd. Tickets went on sale yesterday, so it's only been a day. Now let's go to Universal Express Unlimited, which is, again, very pricey. $199. It's another $40 on top of the extra nearly. What ninety dollars? Sixty nine to one fifty nine. It's almost about ninety dollars. Wow, um, that you have to add on. Having like an extra hundred thirty dollars. Here's Universal Express Unlimited, meaning like you get Express and go on unlimited times Express on any attraction or maze. Now, surprisingly, I mean, surprising to me, I guess it is pretty worth it if you're gonna go spend, you know, all night there. But this is already sold out for for opening night. This, yeah, this is already sold out for opening night. And um, yeah, that's again, only because it's so expensive. Is that surprising to me? So if you're hoping to get Universal Express Unlimited on Thursday night, you can't. But you can on every other day in September. And every other day in October, it looks like. Let's see. Yeah. Every other day in October, but we're gonna watch that. I feel like because that sold sell it sold out so quickly. Um, I feel like the other ticket types might sell out for opening day, um, kind of quickly. So definitely keep on watching that. That's why I'm gonna do this every week. If you guys want me to do this twice a week, I can do that as well. You can let me know in the comments below. But as of now. Gonna do it every Friday, every Friday, um, around this time, around the evening time. And now we go to the after 2 p.m. day and night tickets, which is which is a this is a good ticket. If you go to Universal once a year and the only, once a year is only on horror nights, but you also want to experience some attractions like Seek Life of Pets, um, which won't be open. I'm just getting the after 2 p.m. ticket, especially because it's only $99 on the cheapest part. 
and experiencing Secret Life of Pets, Harry Potter, if you've never been there, because that's not open during the event. And then you can go on Jurassic World and stuff. You can go on Jurassic World during the event, but if you want the event to focus fully on mazes, you know, on Jurassic World and all the rides from 2 p.m. to like 6 p.m. or 7 p.m., and then start doing the mazes and have the rest of the night solely for mazes. So I, I liked, I, I love this combo ticket, and I suspect this might sell out too. Especially because it is only $99, especially on this Friday right here. But right now, it's all open. All open. In October, it's all open. All right. Lastly, let's check the express ticket for this type of ticket. Oops. Clicked the wrong thing. So again, the express ticket for the after 2 p.m. combo was sold out on opening day. That is Thursday. I'd expect Friday to sell out since these are selling out quickly. On, this is now the second time since they are selling out quickly. I expect Friday and the opening weekend to sell out kind of quickly too. And I still would definitely check those other ticket types because it might sell out as well. Let's go ahead to October 1st or October. Everything is good there. And those are all the ticket types. So, yeah, again, already just 24 hours in, a couple of things have sold out. Everything uh, Express after 2 p.m. and Express Unlimited on opening day has sold out. So, we'll be watching that very, very closely. Um, so, go ahead. And again, if you want me to do these videos every week, every more than once a week, let me know in the comments below. I'll add it. To my weekly lineup, I'll do, I'll do it maybe like uh, Tuesday and Friday. It's kind of an even ratio there, so that'd be quite nice. But um, yeah, I'll be doing these types of videos, these videos every week until they sell sell out. And let me know also if you want me to do these videos, the uh, ticket updates for other Halloween events like Okie Boogie Bash, Not Scary Farm, Fried Fest. If you want me doing for other parks as well, I'll do them for other parks as well. And maybe I'll can I'll put it I'll just add on to this video so I'll make it like a, every Friday we can do all the parks but let me know if you just want Horror Nights or all the Halloween events at theme parks in the comments below. But other than that, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I hope it it's helpful to you because I mean it's surprising to me that honestly that the Express Pass, especially the unlimited one, because it's so expensive, um, it is already sold out just a day, just 24 hours in. That's incredible to me. Does it surprise you? Let me know in the comments below. Other than that, have a fantastic Friday. I'll be at Six Flags Magic Fan this weekend for a new update on the RMC Raptor and the weekly updates on Halloween Hornets construction and the backlog project as well as Super Nintendo. So stay tuned for all that and more on Theme Park Wizard. Have a fantastic day.